How are you guys? Today I'm going to talk to you about this little gem here. The 172nd F102A from Ming models. This the case this is a case 20. Um 172nd scale plastic kit. Uh, it's a uh, 28, 29 millimeters uh, length, 16.1 in width. Um, this kit is fantastic. Uh, its unique shape has been accurately modeled, like Ming do in all his models. Uh, wide wing angles and subtle wing angles precisely reproduced here. The cockpit is detailed and its canopy can also be built either open or closed. Uh, the weapons bay is precisely reproduced and the kit contains folded and unfolded, I guess, pylons and two types of missiles. Both landing gears and air brakes can be built either opened or closed on this one, guys. And uh, three paint options on this kit here are provided. So, as always, this this option here and this one here. We have this one here also. Uh, it's very beautiful. It is beautiful. But I don't know. I'm still... I said that I was probably going to do this on silver and on gray. I'm still divided on between this type, this livery and this one. So let me do a little zoom here. Sorry guys, and uh, let's open this box, okay? Top opener, ah, the famous Ming booklet, instruction booklet with a history of the plane and all the instructions very well. The paper is very high quality, it's very good. It's a booklet. It's an authentic booklet. It's it's very good. And it's beautiful. Yes, it is. And I'm divided. I, I'm just between this one and these ones, right? Ah. Look at these. They're all beautiful. The color of On Vallejo. Okay. So, instructions, one, plastic screw, the missiles and the bomb base here. I'm going to open this one for you to see guys, okay? I'm not going to open them all, but this one here has the cockpit. So. Let's try and check this detail out here. I don't know if the camera can. Yes, it can. Look at this. On one seventy-second scale. And uh, the bomb, the gear doors here. Look at this. Look at this level of detail. Tell me if it not awesome and I'm going to open this one also because it has the panel line and I want you to uh, I want you to see this level here these panel lines this is Ming is top of the line for me look at this can you see guys So, and we have this no flash at all. No flash at all. The clear parts. Well, very, 
very well protected inside a bag and on another bag. Look at this. This is very good. This is very good kit. All these panel lines here, rivets and This kit is very, very good. Very good indeed. Oh, decals. This is fantastic. On a proper bag with a paper protection on it. Let's open this one here. Look. Okay. Uh, I don't want to mess this one up. Okay. Cartograph. Printed by Cartograph. This is a 2013 kit, so it's brand new. Look at this. Beautiful, isn't it? It's awesome. I'm going to have a blast on this one. I should place this one. Uh, actually land it because but I, I don't know I, I still don't know so I am sorry guys let me just give me just a few seconds I'm trying to <laughs> place this one here inside again This is obviously this is not cheap. This cost me this costs 30 euros. Okay? It cost me a little bit less. Um, they make me a discount, the very good one also, but well, if you want some quality on the 172nd scale model, uh Meng has a lot of um armor and uh, they their T90 is actually out of this world it's very good it's very good indeed and this one is very good this plane is very good so 30 euros yes it's not cheap but when I saw it I didn't give a damn about it And uh, this one will be built also. Well, guys, this is a very this booklet. This is fantastic. It's this is the Dimorphodon series. Uh, it's fantastic. Wow. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this review here of this little gem here. Uh, okay, it's not cheap again, but I recommend this one. I highly recommend this one. On level of detail, you don't get any better than this. I don't care what you say. It's my... I firmly do believe that you don't get any better than this one. On detail, it's, uh, I don't know, but uh, Chinese lately, they crack a lot of very good kits. So, I hope you enjoy this one, guys, and uh, keep modeling, okay? Keep modeling. All the best to you.